And if you guys can see, there's a white truck there. Yo, his lights just turned on. Did they really? Run, run. <gasps> What's up, film geeks? I'm here with Mos RG. Yo, what's up, guys? And Joey Official. Joey Official, what's up? We're here in an abandoned ghost town in the middle of a California desert. We're just here to explore. Apparently, like, there's people here with guns and stuff. We might get shot because there's like a sign there that says like "We'll shoot if we trespass," but we don't care. We're gonna trespass anyways. Hopefully, it's gonna be a cool adventure, and uh, we're literally melting. It's like how much is it? 130 degrees right now. It's like so hot. There's uh, a school, houses and stuff. There's a hospital apparently. Covered in blood. We might find dead bodies, snakes, skeletons. I don't know. Let's explore, guys. I feel like we're in Breaking Bad. Guys, keep your eyes peeled for some snakes because apparently there's snakes and spiders and scorpions and I don't know what else is there in deserts. Camels. There might be camels here. But yeah, so uh, I've been spending the past week locking myself in my apartment building, editing my short film. So finally I got out of the house. It was like a five hour drive away from Hollywood and it's so hot, but it's so beautiful. It literally feels like we're on the planet Mars. Actually, it would actually be really cool to film a short film here. Okay, so we gotta get over there. So we're gonna go around this way and then to that abandoned building there. This is so cool, like exploring and everything because it always gives me inspiration and ideas for short film ideas and everything. Like this reminds me of Breaking Bad. Oh my god, are those holes where snakes live? Yeah. Are we gonna get bit by a snake? Shit, bro. I'm planning on dying today. It's just a school bus, guys. No, it's not. What's the school bus doing running at this time? Shit. Well, I think that's the wind, bro. No, bro, that was a car, bro. It was a pickup for sure. I'm a thousand percent sure. I thought we got ears open and eyes open. Why, what happens if a truck comes? It might. I mean, nothing. Kill us. So the thing is that we're trying to keep our eyes peeled because if there's a truck, that means that it's probably people coming to kick us out because we're not supposed to be here. It says no trespassing. We're like on the down low. So. There's the town, guys. Whoa, this feels like a video game or something. Grand Theft Auto, right? Yeah, it feels like Grand Theft Auto. Before we do anything else, I need to go into the shade. I'm just gonna chill here for a bit because I'm going to die of heat. Oh yeah? Oh man, you scared the crap out of me. Oh, sorry about that. Anything I hear, I feel like someone's after us. Okay, so while they do the drone shot, I'm just gonna explore this creepy house. What? Man, I wonder if the electricity still works. It's crazy to think that like a family lived here and like had a life and everything. Like, they, they, they actually did stuff. <gasps> Whoa guys, there's like a closet here but I'm scared to open it. Jesus. The battery is so hot. We out here in the desert, steaming it up. I've already, just, just being out here for a good half hour, I'm already starting to get a southern accent. That's how hot it is. Let's see what they're up to. Apparently, there's a church over there and then there's like a hospital over there somewhere. You guys in here? I was saying, I already have a southern accent. That's how hot it is. Check out this bathroom though. Ew, oh my god, there's spider webs all in this toilet. Mirror selfie. Guys, I think I'm gonna move in here. It's so nice and you know, it's like a five star hotel. Just found some bullets Oh my here. god. Yo, I think we just found a real life bullet. Guys, I've never seen this before in my life. This is some real American shit. I don't feel like holding this water bottle anymore, so I'm just gonna chug it. 
it's hot, isn't it? My water's already hot. My water's done. This town has gone to shit. We got ourselves here a horse ranch. Used to be some horses here, but not anymore. I don't know what those things are. Can you guys let me know in the comments below what those buildings are? Because I don't know, they look like little porta potties or something. Yo, Papa, you would love this place. Shout out to my dad, who's a filmmaker. He would go nuts if he saw all of this. Like, you would get so many movie ideas and so much inspiration. This literally feels like an old Western film set, but it's real. Starting to become a real cowboy here. So, we're gonna keep exploring, keep our eyes peeled for some camels and uh, cactus. I'm trying to look like a cowboy. I should have worn like more of a badass shirt. I feel like this uh, unicorn shirt doesn't really go with my environment, but. How we all split up, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, let's split. Let's I'm gonna go into this house. I've done one other exploring video where we explored a creepy abandoned haunted barn with like a noose in it. So I'm kind of new to the whole exploring thing, but if you guys like these types of videos, then let me know in the comments because they're actually really fun to explore. And it's kind of like filmmaking, but documentary style filmmaking. Scope out real cool locations and I get inspiration for short film ideas too. Because actually one way that I write my short film scripts and come up with the ideas is I look for a location and then I write the short film script based on that location. So exploring like crazy abandoned places like this is real cool for inspiration and who knows, I might film a short film here. Look at this. Hmm. And guys, also let me know in the comments if you like, if you spot anything that I don't spot. Like there's a disgusting spider web. Let me know if you like find any dead animals or anything because I'm just like quickly scoping this place out. So, oh God, what is that? That used to be freaking carpet. That is disgusting. Oh, there's a dead animal in here. See anything in there? A snake? I don't know if you heard, but he just said that he found evidence of a snake. Evidence of a snake? That's the head, and it's been slithering. It was, co sorry, it was covered in mud, and it's been slithering. Get out of here. Yeah, that's a snake. What? Yeah, it was covered in mud. It might be even living in here, actually. Oh, that, that's, that is so cool. There might be a snake in here, guys. If there is, I want to catch it. <sighs> Man, it would be so cool and epic to film a movie here. Look, a little lizard. Oh, he's moving so fast. Yeah, I got him, I got him, I got him, I got him. I got him. <gasps> what do you mean you got him? He's alive, he's No, for him! Are you squishing him? No, 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 he's moving, he's moving, he's good. Let him go, let him go! I know who wants to come and grab him. He's himself. stuck! The second it gets darker, the animals come out. Coyotes, really? snakes, <laughs> wolves, you name it. Shit, well the sun's going down and uh, I think we gotta like escape pretty soon because uh, we're gonna get attacked by an animal. Yo guys, look what Mo just found. What's up, my boy? He's like, let go of me. I'm filming with two cameras. Ah. Bye bye, Mr. Lizard. Oh my god, he's like <laughs> a little alien. Look at him. No. He's literally That's like. Cool. Oh my god, look at him. Look at his eyes. Yo, look at the moon though. Yeah. That little dot right there is the moon. He just said he found a noose. A noose? Yeah. Someone tried to make a Molotov cocktail over here. I guess that one didn't explode. That's what people used to like burn down houses? Yeah, they throw, they put gasoline in that, a cloth, and they throw it. Well, why? Why would they want to do that? That ain't no noose. Well, it's a noose. What the heck is this? That ain't no noose. That's a noose. I caught a lizard, a spotted lizard. Pooped on my head. I think I squeezed it. Which house should I go into? This one or this one? And... I'm gonna go with this one. It's locked. Guess I'm gonna have to do this one. Looks like there's nothing here. What? Well, there's like a road. 
more houses. Like 40 more houses. Some of them are gated. All right, let's keep exploring. And you guys can see. But there's a white truck there. And yo, his lights just turned on. Did they really? Run, run. <gasps> I don't know. I think I think I saw him starting to like pull out. Like, what? Should we hide or something? Just keep an eye on the road. Yo, I actually heard a truck. Stay here by the walls. I'm legit scared. Hide by the walls. It's leaving. That's good. That's a good sign. Okay. All right. I guess we'll keep exploring. Could you imagine, like, actually being stranded in a desert and like dying of heat? Like, imagine how we feel right now. But imagine it continuing until you die. Guys, what the? Hey, Let's get out of here. You want, some water? you want some water? Come drink some water. Uh, sure. Check it out. That is a prison. <laughs> the sun is really starting to set, and you can't really tell, but it's like cotton candy skies. Wow. Now we're just walking to see if we can get into this abandoned hospital. Whoa. Okay, so I think that is the hospital. Yo, what? Yeah, right. Ew. That's blood? That's harmless. Yeah. Oh my god. Be careful when you guys can read all walk. Amazing. There, okay, there is literally blood on the walls, and this is a freaking hospital. So, like, these doctors are really bad because they probably just make a mess every time they do operation. <laughs> so, something tells me it wasn't the doctors. I can't get over the fact that how much I feel like I'm in a video game. All right, well, that's the hospital. Okay, guys, so that concludes our adventure at the Eagle Mountain. What, what is it? Ghost Town. Eagle Mountain Ghost Town. This place is an abandoned town with, oh, what did you say? There was over, over 400 abandoned properties on this mass, massive property. Yeah, so there's abandoned a prison. And an abandoned prison, 400 abandoned properties and a church and a hospital. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe to Mo's channel and Joey Official. Joey Official's channel. You guys can check out the vlogs that they did. They explore different parts of the of the deserted town, so you're going to see different stuff on there. And also be sure to subscribe to my main YouTube channel because there you could find all of my short films and my narrative projects. I actually did a short film with Mo Sarji on that one. So you can check that out too. All right, guys. I'll catch you later. Oh, wait. You guys got to go like this. Ready? Like what? Go. Okay. Ready? <laughs> yeah. Catch you later.